Hey y'all, it's Samantha, and today I'm going to be doing a first impressions or like a review kind of thing about the Revolution um, Cannabis Palette. Um, first time ever using this. I've never used it before. Obviously, that's what that means. Um, but don't mind my little thingies. It's not Halloween anymore, but it's the only headband that I can find. So, that's what we'll be using, and if you're interested in watching then let's get to it I used the um, Revlon color stay in 310 and just put that everywhere I just got my little beauty blender beauty sponge whatever you want to call it Now I'm going to go in with the concealer. I'm using the LA's um, Color Conceal It. Just looks like this. And it's in light. And just going to put this under my eyes. Now I never did it right here. Or like here. Or here. But like, why not? I'm going to then take the L'Oreal Paris Hydra, I don't even know the word, I'm sure it's just like perfect, I don't know. Not the smartest, um, and then I'm going to take this sponge, which is like half cut, and we're just gonna bake, kinda. This is the um, Andre Laurent. Let's go show you. Yeah. I'm just gonna dust it away. And then I'm also gonna take that excess and just go all over the face. Reason being is because I just hate when it's not set and it feels wet. Makes sense. And then I'm going to go in with the LA Colors Browy Wowie Brow Pencil. And just do these eyebrows. at night so once again I have no reason why I'm doing this and also am on call tonight which in case you don't know I work at an animal shelter so on call means that I take the 911 phone and I bring it home um, and then if it goes off like from the sheriff's department then that means I have to go out and pick up an animal so hopefully while in the middle of filming this they don't call but if they do that's all right <laughs> Next, I'm going to contour. Um, so, I go in with the Wet n Wild. Can you see that? Okay. The Wet n Wild, and I go in with this shade right here. I'm pretty sure it's 10% um, off, or like Code James, or something like that. I pop it up on the screen. But, I just go in with like the very slight amount, because it's... Um, very pigmented. Okay, 
so in case y'all don't know I'm not very good with contours so I feel like they're like uneven I don't know why I got nowhere to go so that's okay and it's gonna stay like this um also I want to point out is that I don't like carve out my eyebrows with like concealer and stuff because to be honest I'm not good at eyebrows and they need to be fixed because they're horrible also that was with the James Charles palette I don't know if I said that um next so I'm not a very blushy kind of person and like I said earlier is I don't really ever do face makeup so I'm just going to go in with the LA color or sorry the color workshop blush I don't think it has a shade name but it just looks like this and it's pretty old not gonna lie <laughs> Okay, and then we're going to go in with the Morphe Continuous Setting Spray and just set the face. The uh, highlighter that I use is the Wet n Wild um, Highlighter and Blossom Glow. It just looks like this. It's really pretty. So that's what I use. And I use... Um... It's a concealer brush and it's by Andre Laurent. We're gonna go in with the Color Workshop eyeshadow primer and we're just gonna put that all over the lids. And I'm using my finger. Okay, so I feel like there's not a shade really in this palette that would be appropriate, I guess you would say, to set the primer with. So I'm going to go in with, I think it's called Canvas. If not, I'll pop it up on the screen. But in the James Charles palette, this one right here. I'm just going to use this to set the eyeshadow primer. Okay, with the Revolution palette... Um, I'm going to go in with the shade Leaf. It's with the Morphe M433. And it's going to go in my crease. I'm going to go in with the Wet n Wild brush and then with the shade Plant. In the inner corner. I mean, outer corner. I'm going to go back in with that same concealer and I'm going to go in with an angled brush. And I'm just going to like do a half cut crease. I don't know which one I want to do. Either I can do Candyland, which is this one, and do it like a subtle look, or I can do Hybrid, which is this, and do it like very glittery. I don't know. Let's do Hybrid. the M508 smudge brush in the shade plant and we're gonna do that um buff it out on the bottom lash line I'm gonna go with in with two different eyeliners we're gonna go in with the next professional makeup um glide on in jet black and then we're gonna go in with the NYX um, professional makeup epic ink liner for the wing. Lash 
lastly, I'm going to go in with the Unique um, Makeup Mascara Black Waterproof. Okay, so I just did the uh, mascara. I can't do fake eyelashes, so I'm not even going to try to attempt that. Um, but now I'm just going to take the, I'm pretty sure it's a lip brush, but it's by Andre Warrant as well. We're going to go in with the shade Calm. And that's just going to be the inner highlight. I don't like that. It's not broad enough for me. So I'm going to go in with the LA Color Strobing Illuminating Powder. Alrighty, this is the final look. I wish I could do wing eyeliner better because then it'd probably look better at the end, but that's okay. Um, so this is the look that I made with the Revolution Makeup London palette, um, cannabis palette. So, um, if you all enjoyed the video, thanks for watching. If you liked how it turned out, let me know in the comments. I say that as if I have people watching this video, which I know I don't, but that's okay because maybe somebody will. Um, but yeah. That's all. Um, if y'all like the video, then like and subscribe. And if y'all have any questions, comment them down below. Thanks for watching. Peace out.